bounce recording. Yeah, Berlin, dude. I've uh, I've watched you run through uh, through this dungeon plenty of times. Slightly different routing than than I need to use, but and I don't have that ridiculously difficult um, elevator jump thing that you have to do. Bad this run so far. That was on purpose, though. Yeah, those elevator jumps are really hard when you do them. All right, so Berlin, I don't, I don't think that you've been hanging out uh, for this. I spent like four hours last night, like cataloging and tabling and figuring this out. So I've got a reliable manipulation for a boomerang on the beach now, which is pretty okay. So kill these two guys. I'm gonna hit the green dude without killing him. Take a hit. And we've got a boomerang. I know, it's great, right? And it's all so specific, just in the way that, that each of those kills interacts with the RNG and, and loot tables. I mean, Kitsanth, watch watch the last four hours of my VOD, I guess. Cause yeah, that was that was my night last night. I got a, a huge PB, four bounce. Yeah, nice. Saved me half a second right there.
okay, so the reason that that specific manipulation does not work in the original is the reason that I haven't been able to just, you know, use the debugger in BizHawk for everything in the original. So the enemy placement is very similar in this game, but just slightly tweaked enough to cope with the fact that it's a, a 16 by 9 screen and, you know, some things just don't feel as good in terms of enemy placement as if it were still a 4x3. Uh, So what I ended up doing was I used uh, the 8-bit beast, the person who cast the game. I used the notes from that. And uh, and after that, I started just cataloging like everything that I could you know, get out of the game. Oh, give me that card. This is bad. Okay, we're good. Uh, but yeah, so there's, there's not... There's not a good way to use the original and task tools to to work out the way that the RNG is playing in this game, unfortunately. I really should have picked that up. That would have been nice to have. Rogue Link, did you really just join? If you just joined, um, not only did I find the early minute, uh, but I, uh, I showed it off just a moment ago. No, the, the early boomerang is no longer luck. Like, I can get it consistently. Kishario, how's it going? No, it's it's not luck. It's it's an unfortunate amount of hard work, working through every single possibility, but certainly not luck. Oh, luck in the old game. Um, no, a manipulation could certainly be found in the old game. The fact that the task gets a uh, early boomerang in the beach is what inspired me to look for it in, in the remake. Yes. Please go in the door. He's like pixels away. Uh, that's a fake gold. Uh, that wasn't even a very good pace. Um, I guess it's slightly okay since we now move the both manipulations here. Stops being fine when I take all these hits. <laughs> Why not? Let's have three. If I screw up and lose one, we're good. Alright. So, getting that third boomerang is, depending on what the RNG presently looks like, that is um, potentially the same RNG position as um, as a potion drop if I play normally. So we'll see. Money, 
fireball? Nope. There it is. Cool. Uh, could somebody clip this, um, this swamp segment? I need to take a look at the exact number of hits that I took so that I can figure out a good way to, uh, to get that potion drop consistent. Hey, Hoffy, how's it going? I'm not breaking the game. How dare you? I'm offended. I'm not breaking the game, I'm helping it. I'm helping it reach its full potential. Uh... The clip doesn't have to be the entire segment, but at least long enough so that I... I mean, just having the um, the link to view the full video is good enough. So, yeah, just... Some of it. Yeah, Start of the Tower is great. Thank you very much. Drugs bus went past. Is that, is that a bus for drugs or a bus made of drugs? Oh, it's it's just a bus that says drugs. Okay. Okay, so this game can still, like, troll us, but it didn't. Okay. So here's the plan. I'm not going to beef it. That's that's my running plan. We'll see if it works. Stairs. Stairs are hard.
Okay, avoiding flying up to purchase two potions is probably worth it. So, I think I'm not going to take an intentional death. And we're just going to... We're going to feel like the entire run's in danger through the entire next split. It's going to be really fun. I hope that everybody else is going to enjoy the edge of their seat. I will. You must eat all of the drugs before the children do. You don't have a liver, so it's fine. That seems legit. He says, hi, mom. Yeah. Yeah, the whole or, uh, start button being on the, um, on the physical console itself thing didn't seem great. Yeah, yeah, that's the gameplay implication of that. Like, my my Sega and SNES and, and NES all sit less than two feet from my, uh, from my right knee, so from a speedrunning perspective, it wouldn't be that big of a deal, but as a kid, it would have been pretty rough. It's fine. Cool, we're good. Uh, ghost section is coming up, though. That's legitimately one of the scariest parts. So we'll see how that goes. There we go. It's not screwed up. Nope, he screwed it up. It's fine. It's just one potion. Just have to play perfectly, and it won't matter. Yeah, yeah, Tiki. I uh, I was talking with Zephyr, the uh, the current world record holder for Monster World Four, and and we were talking about how he's got a lot more ability to practice strats due to the the really impressive emulation that the the PS3 version gives him uh, compared to what I'm running with, because I'm running on a modified Sega Genesis so that it can use uh, Japanese Mega Drive carts. No! You were supposed to die, not him. Ugh. It's fine. It's fine, we're fine, we're good. 
I'm not allowed to take any more hits this run. Jump. That's not what I said. I said none. That's fine. Drop a potion. Not what I requested. go either way, so... Yeah, watching your tweets about uh, the work that you've done with your PS2 is... I would have a difficult time uh, disputing your claim that you might have one of, if not the... most impressive PlayStation 2 setups in the world presently. Fine, just let me go. We've got to have a really, really good boss fight. And I have to knock beef it before then. I wish I had a uh, heart monitor like Darby and wears right now.
No, no doubles. That's a bummer. <laughs> I think that's a new world record. Yo, Skate Man. How's it going? Yeah, that's a world record. Oh, gosh. Uh, this is world record by two seconds. Hey, Misty, thank you very much for the congratulations. Oh, man. Well, I feel really, really good about submitting this to GDQ now. Hockey, thank you for the one-bit cheer. One bit for position number one in the, in the leaderboard. That was that was a good run. Um, there's lots of time to save still, but that was a pretty okay run. Berlin dude, thank you for thank you for hanging out. Um, really hopeful that you get Wonder Boy 2 in uh, for GDQ so that I can see you again. It was super good hanging out with you for the little bit of time that we had at uh, SGDQ. Yeah, exactly. This is the most okay run that's happened so far. Escape Man, I want Wonder Boy blocks so bad. So I'm submitting this. I'm submitting Monster World 4. Um, I think that John Carls is submitting Wampum. Uh, Berlin Dude is submitting Wonder Boy 2. Like it's. Wonder Boy block could be a legitimate thing, this GDQ. Okay, man, I feel like I asked you already, but did you manage to get a ticket for this one? Because they went, like, ridiculously quick. You did. Awesome. I can't wait to see you there. I'm going to be there the whole week. No hotel yet. No kidding. I got lucky because I'm I'm going with a an old friend of mine, so we're just we we split a room and and it's already taken care of. But holy cow, did the hotel go fast? Uh, hockey, yes. That does indeed mean that the the former world record player Wallet could take my strats because make no mistake, a lot of the difference in this run is strats. Um. I, I implemented more risky strats than Wallach uses, um, but Wallach's run 
using my strats would be faster than this, for sure. Uh, Mav, whether or not we go to karaoke, I think, depends on whether or not Matchbox Matt is there. But I'm pretty sure he's going, so probably. What a run. I feel really good about this one. 